Today we salute the services of, of all veterans, but especially those here at Tennessee Tech. Our department has the privilege of serving veterans and their families from all walks of life who have found a home here on our campus and within our growing community. It's always a pleasure to be with all of you and recognize Veterans Day and, and uh, we'll, we'll say it repeatedly and it, it, it's, uh, it's never enough, but uh, certainly thank you to all the veterans and active service members uh, for your service. Um, clearly there's no single group of people that love this country and that flag more than you do and you have uh, committed to that and we appreciate it greatly and thank you for all that you have done and continue to do. Tennessee Tech and military service are linked throughout our history through honorable men and women. We go back to the first president of Tennessee Tech Thomas Alva Early was often, often demonstrated his love for our country and the military through words and actions. He said, seeing men and women ready to give their lives for the pure principles of democracy assured him that nobility still existed. And I'm glad to say it still exists 100 years later as well. For more than a century, our nation has celebrated Veterans Day, the day set aside to honor America's veterans who served with honor in the armed forces. Originally remembered as Armistice Day, following the end of major hostilities in World War I on the 11th hour, the 11th day of the 11th month, Armistice Day would become Veterans Day shortly after World War II, a day to remember the unwavering sacrifice and commitment of all America's veterans from both great wars and beyond. Today we pause to honor men and women whose content of character led them to stand for something much greater than themselves, collectively seeing to the common defense of this great nation. Their selfless devotion to our great people and to our Constitution really is the only thing that has guaranteed and will continue to guarantee all of us the freedoms we hold so dear.